there was um, quite a number of very interesting questions, and uh, the best one in my mind was about what happens after this year of studies. And it's very interesting to to realize that uh, these people attending the, the school for startups are already looking at, at the, the, the school as you know as a, a group and they want to stay in touch and they want to uh, continue to be in that community after the school uh, will be uh, will be ended for them uh, in November uh, yeah I've seen a few uh, outstanding uh, business concepts uh, and uh, maybe I'm biased but uh, what I saw and interested me most was in the IT software online arena where probably I have uh, uh, a bit more experience uh, but I saw a couple of very promising projects some of uh, uh, a couple of them actually being already rolled out in the market and, and, and delivering some results having some traction and I think what these entrepreneurs need is those answers to questions to their questions helping them to develop the business into the new uh, into the next phase let's say I think they were they were thrilled. I mean, uh, from the way they reacted to some of the uh, videos that um, Doug uh, played to the to the group uh, about the pitches on the Dragon Stand, and also from some of the questions and, and discussions that uh, participants had with me, either in the sessions or or in the in the in the break time, uh, I realized that uh, this is a very valuable thing for the participants because they see, uh, let's say, um, a combination of, of, of two business angel investors that have been uh, doing this kind of um, analysis of, of pitches and business plans, uh, not only here in Romania but also in the UK, so that makes, I think, a very good combination.